And you work often with uh, a second um, counter that has the optical sound for you to work yeah, I w in synchronization with the sound? What I'll do is I, at home, uh, where I do a lot of my films, I have uh, um, a synchronizer like this, but it has two, uh, what, we two ca what we call two gangs. One uh, I use for the image and the other one I'll use for the soundtrack. Uh, the reason for this is when I used to be a film editor, uh, an assistant film editor in uh, Vancouver, what we used to do is synchronize rushes and we used to listen to the, um, like in this port right here we would have a magnetic reader and the magnetic reader would fall onto the uh, magnetic soundtrack so what I do is I, I put the soundtrack on one side and the clear leader on the other, and I'll just modulate back and forth until I hear the notes I like. And, um, and that's, for me, that's the most spontaneous and the least complicated way to synchronize a film, uh, an abstract film to, um, to music. Um, I don't like, um, you know, counting frames, and I don't like uh, uh, making a plan. So I just want to play along with, with a pen. 